We're leveling up in the studio here. Or maybe it's just me. I'm like, it's, just it's, it's you. No, it's all of us. My apologies. Especially you. Welcome back to GMA, and thanks for being with us on this Wednesday as we level up with our next guest, Grammy winner, multi-platinum selling artist, Sierra. She is going to help us all ring in the new year as co-host of Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve with Ryan Seacrest 2022. Sierra, good morning. It's great to have you on GMA. Good morning, early morning, but good morning. <laughs> early morning, of, of course, of course. And we're going to get to the big party coming up in just a bit. But before we do, I understand that uh, Santa and Mrs. Claus paid a visit to your house on the big day. Your kids must have been pretty yeah. surprised. Tell us about it. Yeah, it was so sweet. It was the night before Christmas, and we got to visit by Santa and Mrs. Claus. The kids were so excited. It's, it's kind of our tradition that we do before Christmas now. And they were so excited to put out cookies for Santa, carrots for the reindeer. We did the whole thing. And then I was excited for the elves to finally be gone after that night, which is great, too. <laughs> <laughs> um, I can't hide them anywhere else at this point. But yes, it was amazing. So beautiful. And you have such a beautiful family. You have got your hands full with all three kids. Will they be allowed to stay up and watch you host the New Year's Eve celebrations? They will. It's such a special thing and treat me to do this show every year. To do New Year's Rock and Eve is always special. Um, and so the kids have to stay up and see mommy. They hang up as long as they can. And then when they go to sleep, they go down. But it's always special. It's a special treat for me and for them, too. This is, of course, your fifth time co-hosting the festivities from L.A. What is your favorite memory from the past New Year's Rock and mm -hmm. Eves? Oh, my goodness. I think my first year, you know, being there co-hosting for the first time was such a whirlwind and then also performing my song Level Up, which is a big moment for me then. Um, it just was like a perfect way to celebrate and mark that special time and moment. So um, yeah, I'd say that, that was a special treat for me. Well, speaking of celebrations, this is the 50th anniversary of New Year's Rockin' Eve. I can't believe it's been 50 years. Do you have something special planned to mark the occasion this time around? Oh my goodness, we have an amazing show for everyone. Of course, Ryan Seacrest and Liza Koshy are going to be rocking in New York. Billy Porter is going to hold it down in New Orleans. And then we also have, for the first time ever, we're going to have, we're going to represent Puerto Rico with Rosalind Sanchez. And they're going to do the countdown in Spanish, which I'm excited about. Um, but it's going to be a celebration. So many sweet surprises, amazing performers. At my stage in LA, we're going to have Avril Lavigne and Travis Barker. We're going to have Polo G. It's going to be Manuskin, Walker Hayes. It's going to be insane like it's going to be incredible energy and we're going to have a good time and dance the night away get ready to dance and have the time of your life that is my goal that's all of our goals together <laughs> that, that sounds pretty good to me you know your fans also were so excited to finally hear sierra's prayer the prayer you said that resulted in your relationship with your now husband russell wilson so what is your prayer for 2022 oh so funny my prayer for 2022 is that COVID is over oh my gosh like I don't think I can take it anymore. I mean, I think all of us are just like hanging on by a thread. It's been impacting so many people's lives, but I do believe we're gonna get better. I have faith in it, but I can't wait for that to be over. Um, and for the world to just be back like normal again. Yeah. Um, I'm just dreaming of that moment. I think like everyone else. So uh, side note, your husband, Russell Wilson, was on my fantasy football team. Uh, I don't wanna get into whether or not I made playoffs, <laughs> but uh, is he going, is he gonna be with you on New Year's Eve? Are you gonna celebrate with the family while you're working? Yes, you know, my family's always there, but he's in football mode. So they'll be celebrating for me from afar. Um, and then right at the show, I'll be with them. But, you know, he's in football mode. The season is still going. Um, I'm so proud of him and his incredible journey he's had this season. It's been quite the journey, but um, he'll be in football mode. Um, I'll be representing in L.A. Uh, for New Year's Rock and Eve. And it'll be good energy across the board. And I can't wait to be with them and hug them and just, you know, be with my family. It's always the best feeling of um, to just be there, be together. He'll be in football mode. You'll be in party mode. Uh, we can't wait for the for the big event on Friday night. Looking forward to it. Sierra, thank you so much. We truly appreciate it. Yeah, All thank right. you guys. <laughs> Already getting going. Of course, the 50th anniversary of Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve with Ryan Seacrest 2022. It starts Friday, New Year's Eve at 8, 7 central on ABC. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.